parents and caregivers, this is an update on how to use our curriculum from home. So I'll be sending everyone a login and password for your student, and this will give you access to the curriculum we use in the classroom. Uh, what you'll wanna do is go to n2y.com, click this earth on the side to sign in. And from here, click on student. And then what you're gonna do is log in. I'm gonna cover this for a sec because I don't want you to see the student login. Um, from there, you're gonna see three icons. Um, these two programs right here, Positivity and L3 Skills, we haven't used in the classroom. We use the unique curriculum, which is the Snowflake. So click on the Snowflake and what you'll see is a whole bunch of purple squares and these are the activities that your student can access from home now these are pretty complicated um so i don't really have super high expectations for everybody using this from home um it's a lot different for them to use it on the computer or a tablet versus how we do it in the classroom so um, what I do suggest though, would just be to play around with it before you have your student um, play with it. So for example, um, they're used to doing the math in the classroom using calculators and you know pen and pencil. But what you can do is go in here and for example, four plus three, um, if you click on one of the numbers, you'll be able to um, slide in your answer. So that's pretty cool. Um, click back on this earth button and home to go back to the home page. Uh, what I think is gonna be most useful for you guys is to scroll all the way down and check out this section called my library books. Um, in here, I have just added a bunch of books that are available in this program that I think your student might be interested in. So if you click on one of those, for example, this one's called Dirty Dishes. What you can do from there is if you click this button right there, it will read it out loud to your student in a very robotic voice. Um, but again, it does read it to your student. Uh, they'll have to click the little arrow to keep going or you can read it with them. And if you have a device, if your student has a device or a communication book, pecs or icons, this is the perfect time to bust those out to encourage more communication. So again, this is totally different than how we use it in the classroom where we use paper and pen and project it on the TV and we do small group and individual work. So, but nonetheless, I think that, you know, it's just more, opportunity for your students to stay engaged with schoolwork. So again, go down to the My Library Books, take a look at those, play around with the um, other activities that are generated each day and see if there's something in there that would interest you or your students. And continue to check the YouTube channel. I'll pull that up right here. Uh, if you search my name, Lauren Kamarchek, you should be able to access the videos from there. So uh, please continue to check that YouTube channel daily for fresh content and new videos. If you need any supplies or visual support, social stories, icons, anything at home, please feel free to text or call me. And I'll continue to check in with everyone on a weekly basis. Stay yeah. healthy, stay wow. safe, and have a good day. Yeah. Uh, here's... Here are my kids. <laughs> Amy, can you say hi? Oh, she's grouchy. <laughs> Anyways, take care. See you guys.